morning YouTube. Black Top Bill back at it. Yeah. I know it's been a while. I know it's been a while. Um man. Trials and tribulations of the trucking industry. <sighs> Cold out this motherfucker today. Pardon my French. But um start with a new company today, man. JB Hunt. The other company, you know what I'm saying, I was working for, they was all right. Black owned, you know, more mileage and was making potentially more money, but you know us black folks, man, how some of us do. Well, I was, I was manipulated into thinking that the company was bigger than what it was when it wasn't. And when the truck go down, I went down. It wasn't no backup for me. It wasn't nothing. So I ended up sitting home a lot. And what ended up happening, I wasn't making no money. So I switched companies. You know, and in the process of me trying to get my own truck, you know, you can't just be sitting around, man. When you're trying to get your own truck, because you need that income to keep coming in. So I switched companies, man. So now, starting the day with JB Hunt. Going out uh, with my trainer of the day, who's going to show me the route that I'll be running. I'll probably be with him for the next two days. Be going out with him. He'll show me my route that I'll be running. And I'll be still southeast. Southeastern. Um, still running this base. Well, I ain't def definitely won't. Probably won't be touching that nice Florida weather, right? No more. No time soon, but I'll be in Memphis, Alabama, Tennessee, a little bit of Arkansas. And whatnot. Give me a snack. Another Good or bad thing about it, you know, local run, so I'll probably be home every, well, the first week I know I'll be home every day or every other day until they place me in my own truck, then I'll figure out how that'll work out. But, oh boy, until then. New journey, new start to this situation. Uh -huh. With that being said, you know, I'm still on my journey. And the end game is to get my own truck and get to the real money. Ain't nothing, ain't nothing stopping that. But a little bit of time and patience. Like I said, it's been a while, you know. Had a couple of things going on, holidays. Um, my daughter baby shower. About to be a granddaddy. Come February. Her boyfriend proposed to her so now she has a fiance and I have a, another potential son in law so you know life, life's been great man 
Been back in Florence for a little while with my little family and whatnot. Life's been great. Life's been great, man. That being, this is what I'm in now. The new, the new JB Hunt account that I'm on. We running, we running trailer parts. This will be the um, facility I'll be running out of right here, down here in um, like 30 miles from the house. And I ain't got to find truck parking. I can park my truck out here. Be JB hunting this thing, man. It's a great company if you know anything about it. One of the top dogs in the business. It ain't Western Express. With that being said, man, let me get to this journey, man. Get back up in this truck. It's cold out here. Black top beer out. Morning, morning, Facebook. Coming to you live from Memphis. In that, in that JB Hunt. As y'all know. And I told y'all before I switched company. But now delivering that FedEx down here in Memphis. Got two more days with my trainer. And then I'll be cut loose Monday. I'm now on a dedicated account, which I will be running number of Virginia, Memphis, across the Arkansas line, doing the little deliveries in Atlanta and home every other day plus weekends which is lovely, more family time, and more money, hopefully. You know, I ain't got my first paycheck yet, but time of jail. You know, J.B. Hunt's a great company so far, but you know, every company has its ups and downs, and I haven't experienced no downs yet. Give me a couple of weeks or a month or so and I'll work out them kinks too. Other than that, you know, journey continues. New year, 2022. Still striving for this truck. Trucks are so high and, and at a, well, it's scarce right now. So my next option, I think I'm think I'm gonna try the auction. My cousin, he brought two from the auction and he do a damn good. So I'm gonna think I'm gonna follow his route, you know. I got a um, big cuz she 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 helped me out, point me in the right direction. So I'm now doing a little research that way. With the auction too, y'all you also gotta be careful, you know what I'm saying? What you buy, you gotta get out there and test it and take somebody out there who got the knowledge about the engines and all that, you know. But with that being said, you know, I just wanna tap in and give y'all a little insight of where I'm at and what I got going on right now. And also, these loads are light. Light, too. So, you know, ain't no scales. You got to do no scales. You ain't got to do none of that. Get stop pay. Get mileage. All that shit. With that being said, Black Top Bill out. And I'm back. So, y'all getting a lot more content from me now. I was down and I've been out of work for... Since I left the other company, man, the other company, like I said, it was a great company, but they kind of lied to me at first and said they had nine trucks. Rode with the owner for like a month and a half, two months, and he fucked around and slipped out and asked me how long I was planning on being with him. And I told him until I get my truck, and he was like, "Well, we might as well not buy another truck." So I was like, "What? Not gonna buy another truck?" So I, I threw it red flags. And then another thing through a red flag, I've been riding with the man for over two months and never heard him get a call or nothing about a breakdown, about a delivery from another truck, about nothing. You know what I'm saying? Power to him. Great, great company. Great guy. You know what I'm saying? But it just, you know what I'm saying, kind of shot me a little boo-boo. The food story at first, so that threw a red flags. And then, you know, when the truck break down, it wasn't another truck to jump in. So, you know, a lot of time I was just... When the truck break down, I'm sitting at home. So, you know, I didn't work since, like, maybe December 12th till the 10th of January. That's a month pay gone, you know what I'm saying? 
You know, in trucking, that's a lot of money. A lot of money. So, you know, with that being said, I had to part my ways, not on bad terms. We left on good terms, you know. I let them know, you know what I'm saying? This ain't goodbye. It's just, you know what I'm saying, farewell. You know what I'm saying? We're going to see each other out there long because I did learn a lot from him. The insight of the owner, operator, I got that from him. You know what I'm saying? I salute to Travis and Harrison Trucking. Can't go wrong. You know what I'm saying? They, where I want to be, I plan to be, you know what I'm saying, in a couple of months. Also got my brother, you know what I'm saying? He about to start school. He about to start school next month, you know. So, which is great. Other than that, man, life's great. Journey, family's great. Kids, great. That being said, man, Blacktop Bill out, man. Love you guys.